Hello, welcome to Tiger TV News. I'm Chelsea. And I'm Dylan. Here are your top three announcements. Winter ball tickets are on sale now through November 26th in the Tiger Store. Anyone going to the winter ball must purchase a ticket by that time. Waynesville DECA and FFA are gearing up for their annual canned food drive. The drive will benefit Good Samaritan Food Pantry. The pantry helps hundreds of families by putting together food baskets for Thanksgiving and Christmas. You can give canned foods by November 26. Bring donations to Waynesville High School, Career Center, or Christmas on the Square. Please bring canned goods only. No dry goods can be accepted. Skills USA is hosting a holiday bazaar tomorrow from 8 a.m. to 4 p.m. Items will include crafts, baked goods, product vendors, and much more. This event is free to the public. Contact Miss Music for more information. Well, hopefully, we'll have nice weather for the holiday bazaar. Uh, Dylan, the event is in WCC. But, but you have to get in WCC first. I'm not arguing. We have a show to do. Let's check that forecast with Dwayne. Good morning, everyone. Today's going to be a little chilly and there might be some rain with a high of 46 and a low of 30 degrees. Now let's take a look at the five-day forecast. This weekend should be sunny, moving on to some cloudy weekdays. The sun might pop back on on Wednesday, but the temperature won't be much different with a high of 38 and a low of 24 degrees. Back to you guys. Thanks, Dwayne. The Waynesville High School Library will host a book fair December 2nd through 10th from 7 a.m. to 3 p.m. in the high school library. All proceeds benefit activities sponsored by the library to encourage reading among students and staff throughout the school year. Monday night at the school board meeting, Dr. Judine Blackburn, the superintendent of Waynesville R6 School District, announced that she, that she will be retiring at the end of the school year. She has been the superintendent for the district the past eight years. The district is beginning its search for Dr. Blackburn's successor. We will be right back with more stories after these messages. Hey, Zeus. So what do you think you're doing? Uh, going home, genius. You should wear your seatbelt. Yeah. No, you weren't. I, I really wasn't. You really should wear your seatbelt. What if I don't want to? Shh. You're an angel. are you when no one's watching? Have some integrity. Last week the cast of Tiger TV went to KY3 in Springfield. Let's take a look at some highlights of that trip. Do you remember how the week before we said we were going to go visit KY3 so that we could see how the pros do it? Well, let's just say we saw some pretty cool stuff. It was 
kind of a moving experience to see what we do done by the professionals, to see how different they were from us, and yet how similar they were at the same time. It was sort of a vision into the future of what we could be and what we could do with the skills that we're learning right now. And you know, a little family bonding never hurt. As we all know, Thanksgiving is coming up soon. We sent Andrew and his cameraman RJ to find out what you are thankful for. Good morning, Tigers. So, Thanksgiving is literally just around the corner. And what we like to do on Thanksgiving is kind of say what we're thankful for. Here at Tiger TV, we're walking around asking people some questions on what they're thankful for and what they hope to do during Thanksgiving. So, we're gonna go around and ask them a couple questions, and here we go. Well, what are you thankful for? Well, I'm thankful that I get to come to school every day and see my friends and have friends and family to support me through some tough times I've been through. And I get to spend Thanksgiving with my little brothers and who I rarely ever see. And I get to just be with people that I know that I love me and enjoy my presence. I'm thankful for my family and my friends and my boyfriend and life in general. I'm thankful for my parents for raising me and still being there for me and you know, supporting me. So what are you thankful for? My friends and my family. Well, not my friends. My friends suck. I'm thankful for my family and everything that they do for me. I'm thankful for pretty much life itself. I take it that life is a gift from God and we should always appreciate it. I'm thankful for my family and my little baby over here. <laughs> I'm thankful for Call of Duty Ghosts and Metallica. I'm thankful for my family and just to have good friends. Uh, families and friends and actually the students that work that go to school here. I'm thankful for my friends and my family and yep, band. It's really cool. I'm thankful that my family is healthy. I'm thankful for family and for uh, all of my classes, especially for a band. <laughs> I'm thankful that I'm here today and eating lunch. Mm -mm -mm. Good. <laughs> I'm thankful for working here, my family. I'm thankful for the people I work with and the students I get to work with every day. I am thankful for my family, my friends, my health, and for my job that I love coming to every day. I'm thankful for my parents because they brought me into this world and I'm thankful for my dad because serving in the military and uh, my boyfriend for helping me through my days and just being with me. I'm thankful for my mom and my dad because they're both veterans and without them we probably wouldn't have a safe country or whatever. But yeah, eat lots of food and be thankful for what's right. <laughs> It was great to hear what people are thankful for. Me, I'm thankful for my friends and my family. I love everything about them. They're, they helped me through some difficult times. Um, thankful for Tiger TV, actually. Uh, I love all the people uh, that I work with, and it's just such a great hobby to do. So this is Andrew coming from you live, and we'll see you next time. A representative from the College of the Ozarks will be here Monday, December 2nd at 824. Any senior that wishes to visit with a representative must sign up in the guidance office. Let's look at the available scholarships.
the Square, or TOTS, is hosting a winter play called The Life and Adventure of Santa Claus. The showtimes are November 29th and 30th at 7.30 p.m. December 1st at 5.30 p.m., December 6th through the 8th at 2.30 p.m., December 13th and 14th at 7.30 p.m., and the 15th at 2.30 p.m. Tickets are priced at $10 for adults and $5 for children 12 and under. Tickets are available at Pulaski County Tourism Bureau or Sadie's Gift Shop. The six-hour class has been working on some silent films. Let's see what they have done. Well, that's all we have for today from Tiger TV Cast. Have a great Thanksgiving. I'm Dylan. And I'm Chelsea. Thanks for watching.